What's up guys, it's Olivia and welcome back to Pixar Editing Lab. Today, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to create social media graphics for your small business. If you feel like you wanna amplify your feed, bring some fun colors and designs to it, this is a video for you. A lot of the times when small businesses are marketing new drops or new products, I rarely see people thinking outside of the box. So I wanted to show you guys a fun twist on how to market your product. First, I went to trending backgrounds and typed in sky. I found the background that I liked the most. And then I went to filters, simple, and chose BRL3 just to brighten up the colors a little bit. Then I went into stickers and typed in open present. I placed the box where I wanted it. And then I went into add photos and chose this photo of shoes. I erased it so that the legs look like they're coming out of the box. And I went into text and typed in new kicks. I feel like this is a super fun way to market your product. It's unique. It has some fun movement. I don't know about you guys, but I'm obsessed with this one. Now, if you have a Depop business or anything where you're selling clothes, this is going to be the perfect graphic for you. I chose this photo of a bag. I went into remove background and went to colorful walls. I chose the one that I like. There's so many different backgrounds though that you can choose depending on what your style is like or whatever your color palette may be if you have one. I went into text and typed in the it bag and then I went into fonts and typed in simple. You can use these keywords to find the perfect font for you like modern, sleek, chic. I erase the text so that it looks like it's sitting behind the bag. I feel like this is super fun. You can also do this for Depop or wherever you're selling your clothes. But let's say you want to announce that you added a new product. This would be so cute for Instagram or X, anything like that. And last but not least, this is one of my personal favorites. I think this is a super fun twist on a graphic. I chose this image of a hand holding a phone. I went to remove background, went to background and chose blurry city. I feel like this really matches the whole holding the iPhone vibe. I went to add photo and chose this photo that kind of gives like editorial photo shoot. I cropped it so that it would fit perfectly in the iPhone. And then I I erased the edges so that it would fit perfectly in the iPhone mold. Then I went into text and typed in new blog post out now. And I used the stroke feature to make it a little bit more readable, which I love doing if you have a white text that kind of just seems to blend in with the background. I think this is so fun and so perfect for a blog post. Also, if you're marketing any products or you have any fun launches, it just gives a new perspective and POV that I feel like you don't really see that often. If you guys end up trying any of these ideas, make sure to tag us on socials at Pixar. Don't forget Get to subscribe to our YouTube channel. We upload new videos every single Monday and Wednesday. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye.